Hello, in this video, we're going to compute the value of the tangent of two pi over three. Let's work through this solution. The first step is to rewrite this. So the tangent of two pi over three can be written in a different way. So tangent is equal to sine over cosine. So this is the sine of two pi over three divided by the cosine of two pi over three. So we just need to figure out what these values are. So to do that, we'll draw a quick picture up here. So here is zero, here is pi. If you think of pi as a number over three, so like three pi over three, that can help you determine where the angle two pi over three is. It's gonna be right here. This is the angle two pi over three. This is the angle pi over two. This is the angle three pi over two. I usually don't draw these, but I'll, I'll include these for completeness. And um, now we can find the reference angle. So the reference angle is the angle made by the terminal side of our angle, two pi over three, and the x-axis, it's the positive angle that's created there. And you can see here from the picture that this angle is pi over three, because three pi over three minus two pi over three is pi over three. So you wanna find the reference angle and you do that by drawing a picture. It's really important to draw the picture. So now you say, okay, what's the sine of pi over three? Well, that's going to be the square root of three over two. That's just from memory. So then you have to ask, what's the sine of two pi over three? Well, here's the key fact. The sine of any angle is the same as its reference angle, except the sine might be different. So we have to figure out, is the sine of two pi over three positive or is it negative? To do that, we can again think about the unit circle. And every ordered pair on the circle has the form cosine theta comma sine theta. So on the unit circle, sine is the y-coordinate. So the y-coordinate here is positive and sine is the y-coordinate, so it's positive. So therefore, the sine of two pi over three is just gonna be, I'll write it here for completeness, it's just gonna be the square root of three over two. It's gonna be the same thing. So this is the square root of three over two. Now that we have a lot of the theory out of the way, to find the cosine of two pi over three, it's very similar. Cosine of pi over three is equal to one half. So you say, hey, is it positive or is it negative? Well, at two pi over three up here, let me change the color so you can see where I am right here. Let me go to, let's do red. Here we go, right here. X is negative, right? We have negative X values and cosine is the X, X coordinate on the unit circle. So therefore it's gonna be negative. So it's gonna be negative one half, right? Pretty wicked. So continuing in this way, we have the square root of three over two divided by negative one half. That's really the square root of three over two times the reciprocal, so negative two over one. So the twos cancel. So we just end up with negative root three and that will be the answer in this problem. So that's equal to, the tangent of two pi over three is equal to negative square root of three. I hope this video has been helpful to someone out there in the world who is learning this stuff. Till next time, good luck and take care.